Hey guys, I'm back to buy ourselves a plus. Today is the dreaded Lilith run that I promised. So what we gotta do? Dark room. I think that is dark room, maybe. Well, we're gonna go dark room anyway. And make a save. So take the negative and like, we don't have to go for speed on this run, which is quite nice. But what you gotta do, avoid the negative, at all costs. And, not avoid, take the negative at all costs. But, avoid deals with the devil at all costs, is what I meant. Yeah, that, this room I did, I didn't really work out how to dodge those in time. Did I? No. Didn't get a secret room. Probably should check the other side. Oh well. This. What is this? What is this room? What are these dodges? Since when have I been able to do that? And why can't I do that consistently? That dodge was amazing. Like, dodges against the wall that very narrowly miss the enemy. Makes me feel like a freaking god. And it's like, I am amazing at this game. I can never be hit again. But moments like that make me feel like... I am the legitimate god of this game, the one that told Isaac's mother to kill her son, which may sound a bit statistic, or, yeah, statistic. But, also, did you see the dodges? My brain was functioning. It felt weird. I had a fuzzy feeling in my brain. The feeling of intelligence. Dun, dun, dun. Oh, there's a seed. I've got to look at the seed. A E A F E H 9 H. Fair enough. And also, I'm kind of overdoing the joke. As you could probably tell, I dodged this room. I am a legend at this game. I'm dodging things that shall never be dodged. I'm dodging the undodgeable. Let's go second secret room. It looks pretty obvious. And then that would be funny if it wasn't a secret room. Gulp. I, was that the same pill that I just didn't realize I'd used before. Oh, you son of a gun. I didn't want you to do that. Why am I even fighting this? Just leave. We missed our boss item. Which could have been good. Ouch. Somebody in the comments tell me what that was. I would have liked to have known. Also, did I use my space brightum to fight those two dudes? The two... Uh, Ragman. If I did, shout at me as well in the comments. Tell me what the item was and say, you're an idiot. All in the same comments, please. Like, just put a nice little PS, you're an idiot in it. With a little laugh heart on the end. No, you guys love me. You guys love me so much. I'm joking, by the way. But yeah, still feel free to call me an idiot and say stuff along those lines. Because if I did, I am legitimately stupid. Because... I've seen Northern Line fight those enemies before, and I'm like, just exit the room, please. Please, it's easier on you this way. Pop. Yeah, it's probably the end of this run. Like, I don't want to hate this item, it's just... It's not hate, it's just I haven't found a good synergy for it. So, in times like this, it's not so good. Plus with the fact that I can't aim with Incubus. It's not a good combo and if they could bounce off stonies that would be good if they could bounce off enemies that would be good if they had piercing that would be good I was gonna say another godlike dodge if I made that clearly didn't make it I wanted to with all my heart like this is what pops kinda good for making like little minefields I feel like it'd be good with pier not piercing piercing or like I've had it with piercing so I know it's good with piercing but piercing shot or some sort of a, not really some sort of, just a homing, not homing, homing would also be good, but piercing or shielded, those would be so good. Also, if you can keep doing that spider attack, that'd be very nice, because right now you, you're not getting me hit, you just spawn the spiders and just getting screwed over, and also, this is a very nice we would have pop, which made me regret saying it's bad. Why coating it? Good stuff. This room is not good stuff. A, I can't take anything, because it'll ruin my chance of a thing. 
and secondly, stuff. And I'm just gonna leave. I don't want to risk sitting around on that floor for too long. I want to go to the um, classroom, but I, I don't think it would be worth it. That guy had the shortest shooting animation I've ever seen. My bad for getting here, but still. Yep. This is probably the end. Not to put a downer on things. Bombs are key. I don't need that. Well, you know what? We'll get a charge after this. I'll go then fight the fight room. I'll do it. And the reason I said I'd probably die is because I was expecting the guy in the middle to jump at me. Because he was a champion as well. Use that. Do that. I was going to say it was perth -rowable. And it was. Like, I was going to say, please give me an item here that's either good or that I could perth -row. And it was perth -rowable. As I said, it's totally a word, but it wasn't amazing. But at least, like, we go down to a certain amount of health, it will help us out. Because it's not as bad as an item as I give it credit for, but still. I, like, actually hate you. Hate y'all. Hate you, game, for doing that. And I knew I'd get a soul heart for this, which is why I came in here. If I didn't, I'd have been like kind of confused, but also found it kind of funny because the game would have ended my run by itself, just by its own accord. It's like, no, you don't deserve this run right now. You're screwing up. I have lost the old devil chance. Let's screw it. I don't know if I'll be able to see if what any of these tiers of euthanasia. I don't know if the pop look, takes over it, and it does. Since one of those was euthanasia, that's why this tier is slightly bigger, and also why the enemies sort of went slightly crazy. I will go into both these rooms. That was another euthanasia. Oh, I'm better. I was gonna say I'm so bad, and I said I'm better. We go here again. We need damage upgrades, please. It's not damage. That is ten bombs. Like it's not so bad, but it's not so good either. It's not. This might have to be a um dark room run. Rather than Mega Saiyan, since I don't know if we're gonna be able to get deals with the devil in this room. Or Angel. Preferably. Preferably? Preferably Angel, obviously. If we're going for Mega Saiyan, but. I don't know. That's a good trinket. I like this trinket a lot. It has many uses. Yeah. You saw that, didn't you? You, you saw me. I thought you were the one that does other stuff, but you were the only brimstone guy in the room. Well, that was beautiful. Like, did I hit his, like, little worm thing, and then it exploded? I'm honestly bad. Stop being bad. Stop it. That's good, but it wasn't because of me. It's just the enemy got in the way. I should have been hit there as well. Give me damage. Like, the inability to hit, like... Honestly, I'm kind of coming around on Pop as an item as Lilith. Because you don't hit as often as you normally do as Lilith, in my opinion. But you don't hit... Like, if the shots that you don't hit with can then hover around a bit longer and hit more enemies. The problem I have with Pop is the fact that tears don't go through each other. So if you're... Okay, we got Succubus. Because I'm bad and keep getting hit. But Succubus is good. That's not good. Like, we don't get the damage out of it, since it's technically not our damage, it's Incubus damage, but... Oh, why didn't I get a charge? I'm an idiot. And, of course, the one time I try and dodge through the shots, instead of round the shots, I get hit. Of course. Succubus, I need you. Succubus! I'm not fast enough! Succubus! Succubus! Succubus, save me! Succubus, you're my lord and saviour. Go on, angel deal. I believe in you. I believe! I'm bad, but also we have the void. When are we ever going to use void? Good question. Probably never. I want it for the stats, but you need a box of friends as Lilith. It's a requirement. It's just necessary. Fine, why not? Two succubus, succubi, succubirds, and two inky buddies. 
seems like a good combo for me. And I got like more than I put in at the start of this room, so or well, from opening the chest I got a key back and two bombs I believe. Which makes it worth it as long as I don't get hit. Like right now, just don't want to lose my deal. Devil chance. That's all I want. It's all I want out of this run right now. I just want to accomplish something. With pop for once. Because usually I'm just complaining about it. Like the booster pack items are so cool. One of the ones I really want is the one that I've seen in videos a lot, is Hydrophobicity, if that's how you pronounce it. It's sort of like rubber cement, but not the walls, for the ground. So, like, your shots bounce off the floor over and over. It doesn't seem super overpowered, like, it synergizes with so many items, it's beautiful. Like, it's probably kind of overpowered, but we have not had, in my opinion, an overpowered item in the booster packs. Like, I can't think of one. We've had some good trinkets, like, uh, well, not necessarily butter. Butter's okay. You can do some good stuff with butter. I've never had an opportunity to do it. But one of the ones that I think is amazing is the wooden cross. That's a great trinket. Holy mantle for one room on one floor. That's a great trinket. That can, like, single-handedly save a run. It's so good. I don't think I've ever had it save a run, but it's certainly possible. Hematemsis. Meh. Infested. Meh. This looks like it's the telepills, and I can't remember if it is. It's gold. Sure. We now have a reason to use it. We had a reason, and we used it. Thank you, Succubus. Use it. It did not work the first time. My space bar item seems like... My space bar My space bar seems like it's on the way out. Lately, I've been using it, and it's just saying no. Oh. <gasps> We got magic mushroom! We should have gone into the shop first. No, I'm not rerolling. Screw you. I literally just got magic mush. You're not taking this away from me. I will not allow it. Should have been hit there. Should have been hit. Now this runs semi-strong. More than semi-strong. Like, the tiers or tier rate with magic mush is pretty good. And the fact that we can double our Incubus sometimes, very good. Same for Succubus. Succubus damage scales. Yep. I need a key now. I need a key. Give me said key. I'll use two bombs here to try and get a key. I don't like poker chip. It's basically, you get stuff, or you have a 50-50% chance to get double the stuff. I would rather, or like, it's 50-50% chance to get Double the stuff you generally would, or a fly, or just get half the stuff. I'd rather just go for the straight up, like, half stuff. That seems way more logical. Because, yes, you could get more by going for the double. But at the same time, it's like, why would you? Also, does this border the item room? Because it's otherwise adjacent to two rooms only. It did. Which now makes me feel like I'm perfectly fine to go to the shop, but Kamikaze's not so good. Without bomb immunity, which we don't have. Oh, I'm so glad I went to the shop. BFF doubling the damage of our familiars. And we have 6.12 damage right now. I don't know if it doubles the damage of Succubus Aura. I hope it does. If so, this run's now looking good. I still wish I didn't have pop, but this is now a very strong run. If we get a piercing shot... I'm a very happy bunny. I wish I could get more deal with the angel than devil chance right now, though. And I'm wasting a lot of bombs to get these keys, but we still have bombs to get the angel statue if need be. Should not have used that here. This boss does not call for that at all. Succubus basically did that on its own. We did get an angel deal. I want to take the flight, but I'm going to take this. Because it's another familiar, and it's going to have double damage, and it's a reasonably strong familiar. It's probably one of the stronger ones. Like, I don't want to get the lineup of my familiars too, like, far behind each other, as I generally try and say, but I'm okay with it in this case. Plus, we don't need any more health, which is why I didn't really need to pick up the other one. Okay, if we don't get deal devil this floor, or angel, we're guaranteed to get on the next floor as long as we don't lose our chance! Balls! Eyeball! Budum tish Funny jokes. 2k17. Okay, try and get as many soul hearts as possible. 
can't get them from these fires since you can't get to them because you turned down flight. But you got a good familiar for it. Okay, we did not get our soul heart from Scapula, so it's definitely only half hearts you can get it on. That's what I thought, but I didn't want to say it just in case I was wrong. Not because I thought I'd sound stupid, but yeah, that's true. But mostly because I was just praying in my head that it would work. I was praying, man. Okay, grab that. We have another battery charge back there if we need it. And this is an Excel floor as well. So, two item rooms, don't forget that. Two item rooms and one shop. It takes away one shop that we could have gotten later. But screw it. I will blow these up in hopes of black hearts. And if we get a black heart, I will yare yeah it. Excuse me. I wanted to shoot you guys, but you did not want me to. Sure, use, use two more bombs. Hug lads. Well, I always forget to use that. You see, I always forget. And then I'm left with a situation like that, where I'm like, oh, I shouldn't have done that. I should have just picked up the thing and just destroyed everything with it. But instead, I was an absolute idiot. And this is Incubus, or the downside of Incubus. That hit mildly my fault, but also I was just going around, expecting the enemy to jump towards me, and instead I just jumped wherever the hell it wanted. So rip Devil Chance for this floor, or Devil or Angel, either one works. You know what? Seraphim, you kill him. I can get them into the right permutation to do it. Permutation is a very good word for me. I feel very proud that I used it. Oh, joy of a thousand joys. Oh, and we got two of those guys. Oh, brilliant. That's very good of a card. I'm just going to use that straight away to get rid of it. Okay, and we don't have to go up at all unless we want the curse room, which is tempting, but no. And also, if we make boss rush, I'd consider doing it. Boss Rush, Lilith, very good combo. That was really weird how it sucked the tears away. It kind of confused me momentarily. And we did get hit again, sadly. Oh well, don't worry about it too much. Don't lose sleep over it. I won't, I promise. Good man, good man. Yes, I'm talking to myself. But that's technically what I do every time I record. I just sit in my room, play a video game that I love, and talk to myself. I don't know. Okay, I will go to the shop as well. <sighs> Didn't think I'd make that. Also remember, Brain, there is going to be two boss fights. There will be dos boss fights. Isn't dos two in Spanish? We never learn Spanish. Yes, it's uno, dos, tres, and then something else. Uh, the, the, the word that I can never pronounce, catro or something. Second secret room, give me black arts, I'll yarrow it. <sighs> well, do I play it or do I go to the shop? I'm gonna go to the shop first. I was actually hoping for you. A, you'd give me more money. And B, um, something else. Black upgrade, very good. Yeah, let's play this. If we get more than one soul heart, just double it. Or even if you get one, get tempted to double it. Because I don't know where else I'm gonna use the yarrow. I do not know. There's one. There's a card. I'll double that as well. Could be good. If it's not, then... <sighs> who cares? <sighs> Still thinking about what the first item could have been on the boss fight. On the first boss fight, that is. Could have been good. Moon. Well, I was going to say I want to go to the secret room, and now I have a reason. And a way to. That is a free bomb. Troll bombs are no longer bad, so... To be honest... If you really wanted to, you could just... And yeah, I'm gonna keep this. Yeah, if I really wanted to, I could... Um... What was I saying? Like, this happens a lot. I just start talking. Then my brain just wanders, and then I just end up talking about nonsense. Okay, I'm not gonna use my space, but I'm here as much as I want to. I want to use it on Mom. And I will use it on Mom instead of using it on Boss Rush. Because I'll only have to go through like one or two phases of boss rush to get my space button charged, and I'm not guaranteed to do boss rush anyway. I kinda wish this was a horseman, so I could have gotten a thingy. That's pretty good. Does not come with a tears upgrade. I didn't expect it to. You know what? Screw it. I'm just not gonna use my space button here. I'm gonna regret it, calling it now. But I'm gonna do it. 
And the reason I saved the bomb is like, it was intentional. That was that damage. It was so I had a chance to get the angel statue on this floor. Just in case it spawns, there is a chance. To be exact, there's a 9% chance. We did not get it. Take the negative, I remembered. Stigmata. I'm gonna do it since I made it, and there's a, like I said, Incubus, or not Incubus, Lilith boss rush is good, and I might actually end up gaining HP. And then, maybe it's a good opportunity to use my Yara. Go for it. Like, this is not gonna be ridiculously overpowered to start off with, it's just gonna be pretty strong, but it's gonna get really strong semi soon. Now our eyeballs are red and bloodshot, which is kind of gross. But it's because Stigmata gives you red tears. It's like if you pick up toothpicks, it gives you red tears, if you didn't know. Sometimes I used to pick up that and be like, ooh, do I have extra damage now? And I was like, oh no, wait, just have toothpicks, because that gives you red tears for some reason. And this is when having eyeball tears is good. When you can just carpet the map with as many tears as you want. Maybe it's just a Lilith boss rush item. I don't know. But it's useful currently. It's useful right now. Use that. God damn it, Horn. You're not useful. You're not useful at all. You are not useful at all. I feel like the little horns. Oh, I was gonna say might have died on their own. Apparently not. I was gonna say they might just run into all the eyeballs, but they did not. Still haven't got a piercing shot either. Slightly annoying. I don't expect to have one right now, but it'd be nice. And also, we're not guaranteed to get thingy right now. Also, we maxed out on familiars already. So it feels like none have spawned for ages. Like, we have a lot, but it doesn't seem like we should... Well, it feels like we should have more. It might be because we have loads of succubus that, like, there might be a cap to the amount of, like, max familiars you can have, and not just the same familiar. Let's see, let's see. I thought we were at the end of the chain to see if more were there, but no. Did he just suck in all the, the eyeballs? If so, that's kind of funny. Phrase is kind of gross. Now, if I think about it, oh, jump into the eyeballs. That's also a weird phrase. Can he not jump into them? Because it seemed like he wasn't over the rock, so he should have been able to jump over. Maybe not. I don't know. Use it again. The amount of eyeballs is ridiculous. Okay, it looks like it's definitely doubling now. Looks like it's definitely doubling. One more for luck. We might go for more. I don't know. Right now, I'm just going left and right to just cover each side of the map in tears. And the reason I didn't go right there is because the bloat landed there and dropped some creep. Which is not good for my health. It is not. Thank you, Succubus. You did good stuff there. Okay, don't use space button anymore. It's probably not needed or necessary. Or even smart. Because it ended. We did not get any soul hearts. 100% deal the devil or angel chance the next floor. Please give me the angel deal I desire. And then we're good. Let's guess that. Oh, I was gonna say let's get our charge up first. Screw it. We don't need it. Well, we didn't want that either. That was not useful. That was one penny for a bomb. And I'm intentionally trying to save one bomb, but I was like, well, since we have two, let's try it. Could get an item, could get Creep's head. We have magic mush, but still. Could have been good, but nope. Nip. Nah. Oh well. Oh well. Just try keep the devil deal chance alive. That's all I ask. That's all I ask and all I need is just to deal with the devil to not die. Don't do it. Succubus? Nope. He intentionally waited for Succubus to go past. The cheeky cheeky fella. I, I would usually use this on my space brightman on bosses, but these bosses are just far too easy. Admittedly, they almost hit me with their flies, but for some reason the flies did go towards my face, which is not what they normally do. Euthanasia, you almost screwed me. It hit one of the enemies and then it split into loads of shots, and I was like, oh, balls. That was a very good dodge. I'm giving myself that one. I, like, processed what the enemies were going to do and dodged. Succubus, thank you for like being there. The extra succubus is always helping. There we go. That's worth it. There's another bomb on the other side, which we can get to after this. 
We did get Cricket's head. It's because I asked for it. Like, that's why I didn't want it, because it doesn't give that much damage. But still, thanks for giving it to me. It's an actual damage upgrade. Steven, even though it's kind of silly, would have been better. But let's not get mad. Let's be happy with it. It is going to help. It's not a negative. It's not like getting a little baggy from that and being like, oh, that was a waste of a bomb. But yeah, just be happy. Don't worry. I'll be happy. And it's actually more damage than you think since you have uh, BBF or BFF, not BBF, Jesus Christ. But you have BFF, which is going to help. It's going to help. And I think I saw where the secret room could have been back there, like, probably five or six rooms ago. But I'm intentionally not going for it. Because I really want to try and get an angel deal here. Okay, if we get enough HP, like, enough red hearts on the floor, I mean, that's where we're going to go to get our second key piece. As much as that scares me. Okay, that went well. I did not like that room, but it worked. Go! That was a bit greedy, but it worked. It worked. These enemies are quite nice to kill with eyeball tears. Just sort of blanket the map, wait for the enemies to die. It's quite good. It's quite good. Eclax. Why would you even use it? It's not useful. I don't think... Well, never mind. I was gonna say I don't think you use your space prime here, because he's gonna just never be hit. But then that means you should use your space prime to give it more chance to get hit. Why did he pop up there? He was like two centimeters away from me. That's not okay. I am not okay with that. It is not okay. I am not okay. You better not take away my deal with the devil or angel chance. I will be mad. I'll be more mad than the mad freaking hatter, mate. Just put your butt in the air like you just do not care. You gave me a devil deal. You gave me a devil deal. I take that as an insult. No. I'm not taking it. I'm not taking your stupid... Who's stupid now? Me. That's who. That's who. That's who. It's me. Let, let's. That's who. I'm gonna play it a bit. Then if I get a leech, I'll try and get him to kill the enemies. I was hoping that would be full health. Another X lax Why? I have been blessed. I should have done that beforehand, because then I would have had 100% deal the angel chance. But not 100% chance to get any deal at all. Wait a second. We have Scapula. Scapula can do this. If we just keep entering and exiting that room, we will eventually have enough to do this. And now we have a little brim. Can you see what's happening? I see what's happening. These are just going to turn to bombs. We're fine. We're fine. I'm just thinking right now. Do I pick up the soul heart or not? I'm going to say yes, but let's leave it. So we can try and get more. Like, we now have bombs, so let's try and get black cards from these. Which I was going to try and do at the start, but I was like, well, if we don't get an angel deal on the next floor, there's no point. We're not getting our soul heart back. I want my soul heart back. Thank you. That's not the soul heart payout I was looking for. It's not what I was looking for. Just don't die. I want to go back for red health. If he did the diagonal shot there, I would be dead. Yeah, I was, like, just go back for red health. Well, screw it. Got the key piece. Got a soul heart. We're the bestest of the good. That's a sentence that makes no sense. Ignore it. Ignore it. <sighs> I'm nervous. Mostly because that actually worked. Scapula, like, you have now redeemed yourself as one of my favorites, not necessarily favorite, one of the best items in the freaking game. Thank you so much. You know what? That builds me. Well, I'll go this way anyway. I was ready to leave. You just sped up the process. 
spiders. If that was soul hearts, I would have been very confident. And I really wanted to take Rotten Baby. Really badly. And it turns out I should have. But well, I was going to say we might not have had enough health. We would have had enough health. Because we came out of the room and easily got hit. Which is basically just, hey, rip that HP, which could have been spent on Rotten Baby. Kind of sad. Oh well. We don't need Hush, so this money is basically going to waste. You know, let's not risk playing this guy. I was considering leaving him to play him later. Let's not risk it. We have what we need right now. Which is the key pieces and the negative. We just remember need we just remember need. We just need to remember to go down and not up. Go down and not up. Because otherwise you can't get Mega Saiyan or Um the Lamb. Which would completely ruin the run. Like the fact that I made this run work is hilarious to me and the best part about this run has been scapula scapula has made this run work it has saved me numerous times early on and also the like unexpected magic mush was incredible i gotta say but yeah i feel like i got this one in the bag now unless we re-roll which i would consider if we had like a way out of the re-roll, like, multiple re-rolls. I'm proud of that dodge as well in this run. Like, just going back and forth constantly until you saw the gap. That was, like, intelligent. Use little brim that you got him. Remember you got him, and use him. Good stuff. I was about to say this looks like it's gonna be the right direction. It literally has to be, since there's no other direction to go. I was unaware until, like, I found out, which is a really stupid sentence. Why did I say that? I was unaware until I found out. Well, yeah, that makes sense. It, like, makes perfect sense. You will not blow up in my face. You will turn into a bomb. Hello, raw liver. For even more HP. And max HP. Oh, it feels good. It feels good. And we have a decent chance right now to get a deal of any sort on this floor quite nice. How did that not get in? That was, like, as close as it could have been to not getting in, I feel. Sure. I was about to leave through the front door, but no. Let's, let's conserve HP. Let's not get cocky. Like, it wouldn't even have been cocky. It would just been me forgetting that I bombed through. But yeah. Focus everything you've got. Everything you got. Why am I dodging better as Lilith than any other freaking character? I decided to check twice because the other secret room decided to be mean to me and say I aimed wrong. So, I decided to put it to the test the second time. Apparently it was close enough, but just wasn't there. Which kind of makes sense. Ow. Thank God for that black heart. Because otherwise, that fight would have gone on longer. I'm a bit, a bit more annoying. Oh, of course after I say my dodges are good, I instantly get hit by everything. I honestly thought I would have dodged it, but then I sort of sidestepped into it. God damn it, Twinkle Toes. God damn it. And no, I don't need bombs anymore. We have the key pieces. So I decided to check for secret room. Didn't get it. Use that. Double BFF'd. Lil Brim seems pretty good. Should not have been hit there. That was really dumb. Did not get a deal. Didn't expect one, honestly. Go back, grab that, and go up. I fooled you, I'm going down. I got you. I got you. Probably didn't get you. I feel like if I was watching this at home, I would have forgotten which way to go by now. So I know I've watched Northern Lion do stuff like that, and then get to Isaac and just fail. I'm like, what happened? And now I'm like, oh yeah, he's done the wrong thing. Lol. I don't want to use telepills, because I think... Like, I'm not 100%, but I think it gives you the path upwards rather than downwards. Oh, that, that guy finally got killed by euthanasia. I wasn't even trying to shoot at him. I wasn't even trying. Because I'm an idiot, I decided to go for it. It was not worth it. At all. At all. We have more HP than you think right now. 
Doesn't mean you should do this, but still. Gimme Stompy. I wanted the Stompy transformation. Right now, we can get hit four times before we die, because we have... The Thingy-Mabob. That's pretty good. That makes more Black Cart spawn, I believe. Which, I don't see why you shouldn't take that. It seems perfectly logical to take. 100% logic. Try it. Nothing. Oh well. Oh well, I, I was gonna say we don't need bombs with that trinket. But, that's not necessarily true. We have no bombs. Troll bombs and just random bomb spawns are our only way to get bombs right now. Lil Brim. Beautiful. Beautiful. Okay. Get rid of the flies. Looks like he was probably got rid of the top one. Okay, there was an enemy there. I didn't even see what enemy it was. I just knew it was shooting at me. Or shooting itself at me. And I got scared. <sighs> like, legit stupid. Yeah, I got scared of it. But Succubus killed it. Which is very nice of him. Thank you. Red Heart. And very valuable. See, I was gonna say, seek and secret room. Second secret room. To those of you who are English and wanted a translation from seek and secret room. It's just second secret room, but in a random voice, to be honest. Succubus, save me. Succubus, save me. Good job, Succubus. This attack is gonna be great. Or, well, like, not his attack. My attack's gonna be great against his attack, since the more shots I can get to sit out there, the better. I want to go back for more red health. But let's just, let's just, let's just go. Let's just leave. Let's just leave. Let's just leave. Cuss the blind. That's just annoying. More than anything. Oh, they didn't blow up. That makes sense. Hematemesis. That's rather valuable. And don't go to Mega Seton yet. You want to fight the lamb if you can. Otherwise, you might as well have gone to the chest and got four free items right off the bat. I'm just trying to get both done at once. We're getting low on HP. I would not deny that. Give me the bomb. Getting a bit cocky with those, I feel. <laughs> I don't think we're going to need more than three keys. I know now we're going to get a lot of golden chests and the game's going to just laugh at me, but... I've made my decision. I'm sticking with it. Mainly because I can't go back on it, but still, I'm sticking with it. Okay, let's blow this up as well. What are these? These are two amnesias. I forgot. Bombs are key. Well, at least we can go back on our decision if we need to. Telepills. Telepills aren't bad. Honestly, but I need to stick with this. I need to. Like, I don't know how bad boss... Not boss rush. Mega Satan is going to be. If we're on, like, 2 HP, I think we're going to die. On the fight. Okay, don't pick that up yet. I intentionally... Why to go for that? We got it. And I intentionally want to leave it behind, so if we get hit, we don't lose it immediately. So then we can use Hematemesis for optimum use. Like, we don't even have Permit Polar or Invincibility on this run. It was impossible to get with the negative. Not plausible. I need to scratch my eye. Which sounds painful, but that's just how everyone says that sentence. Is there, like, scratch their eyelid or scratch around the eye? It's just scratch the eye. It's easier to say. It might be false, but it's still easier to say. And if you, like, legitimately crash your eye, that would be freaking painful. Why would you do that? That's, like, a top ten cringiest things to do. And not in the... cringy... Like, in the cringy, that sort of makes your skin crawl sort of way. Not a cringy... How to explain? Um... Dabbing sort of way, you know? Cringy dabbing. If you dabbed... I feel like you either forced into it, started the trend, or had nothing better to do, or were just cracking a joke. I've done that a few times, just sarcastically dabbing, like the most sarcastic it could possibly be. I would never intentionally dab. To me, oh, that's bad damage. Okay, use that. Get your health. We have a good amount of health now. Yeah, I'd never intentionally dab. Like, to me, a dab just looks like somebody who sneezed on their sleeve. And has, like, put their other arm just out to the side for some reason. 
that's what a dab looks like to me. Just somebody sneezing into their sleeve. Half heart. That's essentially a full heart to me. It's no different. Also, there's another heart back there that we didn't take. I would like to go get that. And by like, I mean I require it. Give it to me now. Come on, little brim. Double damage, little brim. Do your thing. Okay. Carpet the land. Dude. Just die. Please. And now we'll find out, like, after we either beat Mega Satan or die. Since I think the lamb should die fairly easily. Since we're quite strong now and have a decent amount of health. But that's when we're going to find out whether... Also, how far are we away from the fight? Like, Jesus Christ. Yeah, this is when we find out if this... Or we've done... The chest or the dark room? Because I don't know. I'm pretty sure we did the chest first. Like 90% sure. But there's that 10% that's like, you might be a complete idiot and doing this for no reason because it's got four items for free. Also, apparently it's looped all the way around, so I didn't need to do half of that like path I did since it's not going to be off any of the other branches on this floor. There's like one other place for it to have come out of. So I could have just gone up here and saved me like six weeks of fighting enemies. We did get a lot of health along the way, but still. For comfort reasons, it would have been nice if it was closer. But, let's be happy about it. It got us stronger. Health-wise. Soul hearts. God damn it, just two bombs. And I remember they were bombs and not troll bombs, since I have the bomb diffuser thing. Spider bite. Sure, it's okay. Not a secret room. I'm doing this room to try and find the second secret room. I'm having regrets, because I know how hard these guys can be. They are not the easiest of enemies. They are on par or worse than Mega Fatty. But Mega Fatty tends to do faster leaps, so I'd probably make Mega Fatty harder than this guy. Or say he's harder. For me, at least. I'm going to check this again, because I don't know if it'll straight. Sexy Groom's definitely not there into the fight. We can get another battery charge in a minute, because we have a battery sitting on the ground somewhere that we can use. You're going down, dude. Bad damage. Shouldn't have said that to his face. It, it highly offended him, could you tell? He's highly offended right now. Good stuff. And no, I'm not doing a victory lap. And yes, I'm gonna go fight Mech Satan. And screw it, I'm going down this way just because it'll probably be probably be faster. I take it back. Two cages. Probably not faster. Probably a lot slower, if you ask me. Or at least more difficult. Yep. And I was gonna say after that, probably gonna get us hit. And he did. We didn't even get our red heart back. You son of a gun. Oh well. Back we go. You know what? I'm gonna just full click. There's one room left. And we have another battery charge if we need it. Grab that. Wasn't that useful? It's like, exactly the same as if we, like, didn't have it. But it's nice that the game gave it to us. It's nice. We did the extra room for a single key. Sure. And a penny. Why not? Let's grab the battery. And fight. And fight. I think we've got it in the bag, in my opinion. There is a bag, which it is in. Amnesia, on the key, sure. 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 Don't take telephone, just in case you accidentally use it when you don't want to. I know what I'm like. I've done it before. Or at least using a thing without meaning to. Or having it accidentally get used. In circumstances that I don't believe are my fault. Like that time when I failed greedy mode when I was lost. If you didn't see the stream, you won't understand what I'm talking about, but still. Ooh, free bombs. Thank you very much, friend. Highly appreciate it. The enemies that go off the screen and then come back, like, war, they just get completely screwed over by the fact that I have pop. Since they're just gonna go off screen, come back, and there's gonna be a load of tears on screen, they're gonna be like, oh, balls. Eyeballs. See, I can use the same joke over and over and it's still funny, right? No. We got hit. Don't know what by. I think it was a brimstone beam. I'm not sure whose brimstone beam, but I'm pretty sure it was one. It's probably gluttony, but I don't think gluttony is in the right position. But, oh well. Four hearts. 
go fight Angel Statues. Angel Statue, this one's dead. Then just Mega Saiyan. That does not seem that bad. Like, it's just Mega Saiyan, then his second phase. Or his skull phase. Okay, we lost more health. I still don't think it's that bad. Since I've been a bit cocky, admittedly, but... I think we got this. Have we done the Void? We have done the Void. Let's not do the Void. And also... It says I've now done the Dark Room. I could have checked the post note that whole time to find out. Oh, Lilith. I don't have to do anything with you ever again. Feels good. Feels super good. I didn't even use the Void. Good run. Succubus now put in the basement. We didn't have that. That's not good. But we do now. Dark Baby and Big Baby. Three unlocks as Lilith. I think we're now on a three win streak. Four. Even better. So we've now finished one, two, three, four, five, six, seven characters. Eight characters. One, two, three, four, five. Six to go. And two of them are the hardest characters in the game, but still. Not that many characters to do, and a lot of characters done. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Hope to see you play yourself. And I'll see you guys next time. See ya.